Um, this is Fat for you here, and I'm here to show you some mods that I have for um my single player. Um, okay, so the first mod that I have is called Moe's Creatures, which basically lets all these animals spawn. It has a bunch, like 20 some animals. And then the second is I have commands. So I can type spawn bear, and then there's a bear. Or I can spawn like 10 bears or something. 10 bears. And the personal mod lets you like change your jump, change your speed, change your health. Um, lets you randomly explode like a creeper. Um, you can change times of the day. It pretty much lets you do everything. And you can give yourself items. And as you can see, this is on um, beta. It's on um, January 16th, I would think, today. January 16th. So, let me check. Um, yeah, January 16th, 2011. So, these do work. And, but basically, I'm going to teach you how, how to install them. And as you can see here, I can change my, um, my jump. So I can jump really high. I have the fog on really high right now because I'm exporting a video. Um, you don't usually need it this high. And so far, I haven't had any crashes or anything bad, but this should be an in-depth um, kind of walkthrough on how to do it, because there aren't many on how to install these two mods. And uh, here I'm trying to show you how I can give myself stuff. Let's see? And it gives you 64. Um, flying sucks. So now I'm going to show you how to... Um, Add the mods. All right, here we go. Boop. Boop. So let's first go get the mods. Of course, it's kind of important. Um, you need to um, you should always try to make a world with your Minecraft if you don't already have one. Um, because that just gives that makes the game an entirety. The game has every part it needs to play, which means it's not going to be missing any pieces or anything later on. Um, Alright, close some stuff. Alright, so first we need mod. Come on, mod load loader. Um, now, mod loader, basically what it does is it keeps all of your mods separate. It makes sure that none of them interfere with each other. Now, as this is pulling up, you also need something um, called um, the unarchiver. It's right here. What it basically does is it it does it opens RAR files, which is really nice, very important. Um, go get this right now. And there's another thing you should get called um, treasure chest um, treasure chest and what it basically does is it backs up your saves so get that for Mac and open that and do that before because I don't want you to lose anything okay I have all that backed up okay so back to um, the mod loader this link here um, it's gonna say mod loader beta 1.20 download that um, Click here to start download. And just leave it in your downloads for now. Um, and again, you should you should try to clear your um your desktop. I gotta let me just do something real quick. If you haven't made a world yet, just make a world, delete a block, and add a block, and then quit. It's just what I do. Um, okay. So now we have mod loader. And it's going to come up like looking like that. And if it does come up like that, that means you did it correctly and you have an archiver. So now go down and get audio mod beta 1.2 and download that as well. Now we need most creatures. Okay. Boom. Um, go down, there's going to be a bunch of pictures of animals, go down, and right here, here, when it starts having all the versions, get this one, 
most mo creatures mod 2.4. At least I think this is the one. Let me check real quick. Um, let's look. So doesn't I don't see any links up here. Oh, I've been downloading the wrong thing. That has been my problem. So you want to download that. And make sure it's a RAR file. Okay, so should get that done. Now type in single player commands Minecraft. Minefart. Minutes fart. Um <laughs> Yeah. So Shut up. I hate advertisements. Okay, and you want to click on the file front. The direct download one isn't working for me. And you just want to click there. Um, I'll have links for all of these in the description. So, you you want to have all these saved at your um. And you should have four saved. Open in Finder. Now take all four, drag them onto your desktop. That's three. Really? Did. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so there's four. Four you should have audio mod, mod loader, most creatures, and the, um, the commands. Now, what you're going to do is highlight them all, right click, open with the unarchiver. And what it's going to do is unzip all the RAR files and give you folders basically that you can um you can actually see what's inside of them okay now go to finder your name library application support and minecraft now you're going to see a minecraft.jar file right click it open with archive utility which should be on your computer and then drag minecraft.jar to your your desktop and and after the minecraft part this should be the, the folder that it on archives you should add a dot jar and then hit ok it should say add add so basically the application thinks that that is the folder um, now what you want to do is you want to start adding things so open mod loader you're gonna have eight eight class files I believe and and um copy or cancel don't stop sorry just drag them in I don't trust copy and paste it's gonna ask you to replace a few times just replace them now go and let's do audio mod now or crap wait before we go any further go to your meta and delete this. Just throw it into your trash can. It's stupid. No one likes it. And it'll it'll pause your game if you if you don't do it, and then it'll really mess you up. Okay, now go to your audio mod folder, um, IBXM, and drag all of the class files into into your Minecraft.jar with all the other ones. And now, if you um go into your minecraft.jar and, and there should be a Paul's code go to sound codex and there should be two class files if you go back into your audio mod and you go to codex there should be one you drag that in so there's three one plus two is three <laughs> now um, go back I don't know why I just left go back to your your minecraft dot jar and you now let's add most creatures um, so here it is you're gonna go to files to inject to minecraft.rar highlight them all except mob 
it's a folder. If you add it in, you'll get invisible creatures and it won't be fun. Um, but what you do want to do is go back to your Minecraft.jar, go type in mob, and you should find a folder in your Minecraft.jar labeled mob that has PNG files of all the animals that are currently in the game. You want to drag all of the ones that are in the most creatures folder in and add them. Don't replace, add them. So you should have um, a good amount of animals, hopefully. Now go back to your application support Minecraft. Um, here you should be able to look. This is what I did to get there. Um, go to resources. Now it doesn't matter how many things you have up. You could have none, you could have two. Either way, you want to drag your mod folder into there. It's very important. Okay, now moment of truth here. Let's see if Minecraft will load up. I've done this so many times today, but I think it was because I was downloading the wrong um I was downloading the wrong most creatures, I hope. This should work. Cross your fingers. Yes! Victory! That usually means that it worked. 99% of the time. Unless you forgot to drag something, you should have most creatures now. Now, it'll take a while for them to spawn. I'm not going to waste that time. I'm just going to take it as they're here. So, that's awesome. I'm going to jump up here. And let's go back to um, your minecraft.jar you can you could go and add a a um, like a shortcut here but I don't I don't mess with it um, now open the commands one take the two class folders not the net file just the BZ and player helper and drag them into your minecraft.jar and it's gonna ask you to replace your place and now go to net in your in your um minecraft.jar again you go to minecraft client there should be two and there's gonna be one in your in your in your um commands folder you wanna drag it in and replace the minecraft.class okay now you change that you want to make sure you don't replace the entire folder just replace that one thing in there so now hopefully we should have all the mods um, let's check real quick and if you have any any questions or need help with something just just leave a comment I will definitely help you if you need help uninstalling it or installing it. So there you go. Now I have commands. Spawn fox. I'm just spawning foxes to prove that the creatures pack works. Um, a list of the commands can be found where you downloaded the um, thing. I'll post a link in the description. Um, please subscribe. That would be awesome. Um, I think I just lagged the crap out of my game. Alright, bye.